Hello everyone, good morning. This is Paula and I'm here today to do a flip through of number one and number two journal. They will be listed separately in um, Etsy after the video and um, they will be listed as number one and number two. Okay, Christmas Traveler's Notebooks. Okay, so first of all, they are stunning. Look at those. How could you get any more beautiful than these little guys? Now, they've got these beautiful beads. Okay. These are Christmas in pastels. And kind of a silvery glitter in this one. And gems and sequins. Some leaves coming out of the... The flower, which has a po white poinsettia on it. Pink lace back here. Fabric that's just stunning. And you can see the fabric on the back, too. See, and there you can see the, the shiny, glistening paper that the journal is made out of. With white seam binding, of course, because we're doing it very elegant. And normally I don't do elegant at Christmas, but sometimes you just want to, right? Okay, so we're gonna do number one first. And let's get started. So there's 20 pages, okay? Uh, so we'll count them. One, two, three. I wanna make sure, four, five, six. Okay, 17, and then you double that for your total front and back. And this is what is recommended for a journal is 15 pages. So you got a couple extra, what can I say, on this one. I don't know, I'll have to count the other one too. All right, so we're going to go inside. I didn't go crazy with decorating. I figure you guys can go crazy and do it like a December daily if that's what you have planned or just journal the month of December. Or even could be winter because it's got a cold look to it as well. So I used a dually here behind the library pocket which I collaged with vintage music sheets and added that also to the top of the library card and the top of the pocket. And you can see the dually here behind it. And then we've got this little pink tag that I just kind of slipped down there. And these two tickets have Santa and his sleigh on them. I stamped those on there. We've got avocado paper. We've got a lot of flip out pages. Over here, you'll see that I stitched Christmas trees on one side of the tea stain paper. Here is a stationary sheet that says Merry Christmas. A really beautiful different dually. Look at that, isn't it pretty? Okay, and then we have this beautiful pink speckled paper. And I've added lace in four different places, which is plenty for this book. There's the pocket with a little village, Christmas village. And this is one of the um, Christmas cards that were changed over into a tag. And I wanted everybody to get one in my books this year. So, there you go. It does have a red ribbon. We'll just not pay any attention to that. More tea stained with Christmas trees. I keep bringing it up here. I'm just afraid you won't be able to see it. But you will. Okay. More fold-out paper. Kind of a ledger type paper. Notebook paper in avocado. Music sheet. Tea stained Christmas trees. Vellum or tracing paper. Cute pink pocket from a bag with this cute dolly here. And a shaker card. 
So I'll hold it up. You are magical, it says. Some cute little white speckled flowers with little beads in the middle. Goes right into this pocket. Another piece of avocado paper. And we've got a glistening pocket with music sheet and this beautiful tag with a cute button. And this came out of the Christmas paper too. Here we have, I figure with the snowflakes, we needed to have a snowy day. And that's a church on that side. And this side is just a cute little story that's very vintage, okay? Now here's some more tea stain paper with Santa, avocado paper, a beautiful dove, Christmas card, gray speckled paper, and this is a side pocket that says 25 for Christmas, has poinsettias on it. And then we have this cute little ornament. Do you know I just realized I didn't turn my lights on? Hold on and I'll hit a light. When I saw the shadow, I realized it. If this doesn't, if it's not bright enough, uh, <laughs> Big difference, right? If it's not bright enough in the beginning, I'll redo the video. I'll watch it to see. Okay, and then we have tea stain paper. There's the center where the beads are. And then we have snowflakes on the other side. Here's another cute little pocket with a tag with some pretty pink lace. Here is a journaling card and it has a journaling card inside. I mean, there's an envelope with a journaling card. Oh, help me, Rhonda. I don't know what I'm talking about in some moments, right? <laughs> you guys ever do that? Okay, here we go. Snowflakes, there's the snow on the other side of the picture of the church. I just, it's beautiful. Those came out of the idea books. They're very old. And here is another pocket from the bag. And I put holiday wishes. And snowflakes full of cutoffs from the papers in the book. And it fits perfect in our little bag. I tried not to let things get too bulky. And so... You'll have room to add pictures and different things, numbers for your December daily. Here is some of the really cool pages that's in this book. Avocado paper here. Here's some more of that computer paper. Snowflakes. Here's another cute little pocket. Isn't that pretty? I tried to make it as sweet as I could. This speckled pink paper. Here is the dolly. Rest of the journal sheet. Has a big snowflake on it. More tea stain or avocado stain paper. I like the kind that they just make it look like it's been poured. Here is a bag, and it says the most wonderful time of the year with three rosettes and three white flowers on a cute little tag. And then look at the little corners. See how I did the little corners? So this journal is a beautiful journal, and we'll have it in the Etsy shop when you see the video air. Journal number two, um, and it's... Everything's the same in both of these. So, not the exact same, but, you know, you have as many things. Uh, this, These books are eight and a half by four and a half, like your standard journal. There is the beads on this one. It has some little poinsettia sequins with beads in the middle. It has this, of course, seam binding. I'm going to undo it so you can see. This beautiful wreath on the front. Isn't that pretty? And then we have this pink rosette 
with a white pearl. And then we have white leaves on this one and snow in the background with this beautiful pink check, pink and white check. On the inside, we have Santa that I stitched and glued in. I just thought this book needed to be a little different. The pockets are a little bit different. One's shorter than the other. So, but we have the same sort of thing. It's made up the same way with collaging a vintage music sheet. Santa and his sleigh stamped. Then we have a piece of vellum that it's on, actually. It's on a piece of vellum. And then this one is Joy stationery and all the different laces. All the laces on the sides are different. Each one is different in the book. Santa's Village. Look at that little gold I put on here. And that's to welcome this cute little Frosty. Isn't he cute? And he folds out so you can have fun right there. We also have the Santa, I mean the Christmas tree stitching on all the tea paper. Avocado paper right here. Both of these are avocado dyed. Another tea stained. Music sheet. Here's another uh, bag with a shaker card. This time I added gold sequins and a little gold poinsettia, okay? Speckled gray paper with a Santa card that I made. Next is some tea stained paper with trees. Here is some pink printer paper, pink printer paper, Blah. and some gray speckled and some avocado lined paper computer paper, pink paper, speckled pink also. There is that pocket. Here's that a, a vellum dolly on this one. I tried to do things a little different. Here is the inside where the beads are. So there are slight differences. Different laces, fold out pink. More of almost like a fuchsia. Tea stained paper, avocado stained, lined paper, folds out. Here's your envelope, which has a journaling card inside and a clip here. They both have clips. Here is that same paper and tag I made. Here is this cute um, side tuck, which there's one like this in the other book, only it doesn't have Santa. has has the, the uh, Christmas ball. Okay, and here's another bag. This one is uh, the check. And it says holiday wishes. That's got the cut off paper. Gave you a little notebook like. Avocado. These avocados have doilies on them too. You'll be able to tell that in the, in the, um, here's some more of the snowman wrapping paper. Isn't he cute? And here is the bag that I added in the back that says Warm Holiday Wishes with three rosettes. And this is the tag I decided to put in here. And yes, it's bright, but all of them were. And it has a little bit of gold, which I think Frosty here likes that. We'll put that right in. And more of the stationery and vellum. And then this beautiful inside in the back. This is made out of the Santa Santa Baby paper. So I think you'll love these. And I'm going to put them in as number one and number two. This one is number two with the reef. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.